जगन्नाथ जी आपने बहुत बड़ी बात कही एजुकेशन के बारे में एंड इट्स रिक्वायर्ड आई मीन लेट्स नॉट फूल आर सेल्स एनी मोर वी आर बीइंग स्वेप्ट इफ वी डोंट स्टैंड अप एंड वेदर इट्स ऑक्यूपेशन ऑफ पब्लिक स्पेसेस और इट इज यू नो इंपोजिंग देयर हलाल ऑन अस इफ वी डोंट अवेकन एंड दैट स्वामी विवेकानंद जी सेड कि अवेकन अराइज एंड असर्ट and i add my fourth v uh, a to that is act is mm. omendra ji is a classic example of somebody who Absolutely. saw the an- anomaly and began to act on it and kudos to you for that so pravin ji as an educator as a professor and as jagannathan ji was saying that you know it would take decades but can the technology leap in the way we communicate now can it potentially accelerate the process of change that as we know now that 5 trillion is easily achievable let's talk about 10 so how can technology in this moment in time as a as a professor you think that it can really accelerate so that it doesn't have to wait for decades what must happen okay uh, before i come to that question let me speak a little bit on the halal part and uh, and how it has you know basically taken over uh, a similar instance happened in the usa some time back if you remember everybody hated to buy made in china products but nothing happened because the choices were not there uh, you could not buy products that were not made in china it was a serious headache to to be able to buy my wife is very much against made in china products it was very very difficult to do that uh, government had to take an action as soon as the sanctions were imposed on china things changed Uh, we started getting more choices so governmental intervention is definitely needed for halal part people will be uh, i'll give you one example there is a restaurant that is opening here locally and he needed a lot of help and i helped him and i asked him what kind of food will you be serving halal or otherwise and he gave me the economics of it the cost of getting a non halal food is expensive halal by the very nature is so much larger in supply chain that they can provide at a lower cost so unless you provide them a very steady source of customers who are fully aware of it nothing will happen it's very difficult people talk but when it comes to spending real money they look at which is cheaper that is why made in china was selling that is why halal is selling so like the way us took a sanction against uh, chinese product put huge uh, tariffs on them uh, i think the indian government has to do something it is not something that individuals can make a movement uh, it just is a too big of a job for somebody to do it you know so i hope the government of india officials are listening to this and are aware of it and are doing something to that effect i think a question was about awareness are people is this going to take much longer time or the technology can play a role i think it is already playing a role i think people are a lot more aware of what is happening around them now amrinder ji mentioned about these uh, whatsapp videos on people spitting on food people are very very aware you look at social media it has transformed and i think the right has just definitely awakened in india you can look at some of the videos that you have uh, with rudi ji and look at the views you had for different kind of videos that tells you a little very clearly where the country is moving so i think that change has already started and we can have a separate show on that one but i think the social media is doing its job plus there are a lot of people who are producing a lot of content for knowledge and awareness there are organizations in usa i mean like hindu american foundation and hindu university of america they are producing content left and right there is a demand for it and people are learning there are, i know colleagues who are going and taking courses in hindu university to learn about sanatan dharma people like me who got educated in india without any education on religion or on hinduism and sanatan dharma and perverted uh, uh, history of india uh, which basically was a one sided view so i think a lot is happening that's one area where i'm comfortable the government does not have to do that much there is a enough social awareness that people are learning through these media and as long we keep those medias open and make sure that content is coming to educate the people i mean like with the example of amrin ji i mean we learned today and i'm sure this video will educate a lot of people 
about what he's doing, his foundation is doing, and I'm definitely going to contribute to you, to your foundation starting today. And I will tell everybody in my group to do it because I think these are the kind of things which will bring the change that we need in an exponential fashion. So I'm, I'm with Mr. Mrenduji. I think it will happen faster than we realize. It is a silent coup that is happening and it has to be supported by all of us and not simply watch the program and move on with our life. I think we should pay attention to that and become part of the movement silently. It's, it does not take a whole lot of our time, effort, or money. We should really encourage people who are doing the job. They are the true Kshatriyas. And if we don't understand what Kshatriya is, let them be just be a participant in the process. So that's what my take on that is. It will happen. I don't think we have to wait for that long.